Hi everyone. In today's video, I'll show you how to enhance the security of your TradingView account by setting up two-factor authentication. I'll start by going to tradingview.com, typing in the website name, and logging in with my username and password just to walk you through the entire process. If you're already signed in, feel free to skip ahead. Once you're logged in, look up to the top right corner of the page where you'll see your profile name or avatar. Mine just shows an initial, but if you have a profile picture, it'll display here. Click on it and from the drop-down menu, select Profile Settings. To activate two-factor authentication for your TradingView account, go to the Privacy and Security tab. Here, you'll see a few options for securing your account. First, there's the Authentication App option. This allows you to retrieve codes from an authentication app on your device like Google Authenticator, Duo Mobile, or Authy. Second, there's phone verification, which sends a text message to your mobile device when signing in. For this tutorial, we're going to go with the first option. So click the Enable button next to Authentication App. After clicking Enable, you'll see a screen asking for verification options. To enable two-factor authentication, TradingView needs to send you a confirmation code. In this case, it will be sent to your registered email address. Select your email, which should be partially hidden for privacy, and then click on Send Code. Next, check your email for the confirmation code from TradingView. Once you have it, return to this screen and enter the code in the field provided. Then click on Submit to confirm your identity and proceed with setting up two-factor authentication. Now we've reached the final step. TradingView has provided a two-factor authentication QR code, which you can scan using any Authenticator app. Like I mentioned earlier, you could use Google Authenticator, Authy, or any app you prefer. For this video, I'll be using the Authenticator app by 2Stable, since it's available on my Mac. So, in my Authenticator app, I'm clicking the plus button to add a new account, then I'll just hold it over the QR code on my screen. The app automatically fills in all the necessary details like the secret key, account name, and service name. It even displays the TradingView logo. Once everything looks good, I click Save. Now, my Authenticator app generates a six-digit code. I'll enter this code back in the Authentication Code field on TradingView, and finally click Enable to complete the setup. With two-factor authentication now enabled, TradingView will provide you with a set of backup codes. These codes are essential. If, for any reason, you can't access your Authenticator app, these codes will allow you to log into your account. I highly recommend saving them somewhere secure. You could store them in a password manager or even write them down and keep them in a safe place. This way, you're fully protected even if you lose access to your Authenticator app. And that's it. Your TradingView account is now fully protected against hackers. Let's do a quick test to see how the login process works with two-factor authentication enabled. I'll start by signing out and then signing back in. Just type in your email and password as usual. And now, as you can see, we're asked to enter a verification code from the Authenticator app. So I'll open my Authenticator app, find the code for my TradingView account, copy it, and paste it into this field. With that, we're successfully logged in. Two-factor authentication is now fully set up and working. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this guide helped you secure your TradingView account with two-factor authentication. If you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more tutorials on enhancing your online security. Feel free to drop any questions or comments below and I'll be happy to help. Stay safe and see you in the next video.